ocean stripped all the labels off our cans that got rusted. Now we got to eat them. It's all beans and corn and peas. Okay, this is what Come on, corn! Give me 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 corn! Corn! Beans! <laughs> One more? Yeah. Hey, let's see what it is. You have the best. Let's go for the best before. Four beans. No wind. We're completely becalmed today. It's no wind whatsoever. So we're just going to fish and eat. Hey, fishy, 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 fishy. Oh, there he is. Right now. <laughs> Lunch. We are now skirting the edge of the North Pacific Gyre, roughly 1,000 miles east of Hawaii. And we're finding lots of plastic on the surface of the ocean. It's mostly small fragments, blue, green, white, and black, among many different kinds of zooplankton. Everywhere you go in the North Pacific Ocean, we find plastic. So I filleted this fish, thinking we're going to eat it, and here's what I found. It's full of plastic. This is the whole reason that we're out here, to bring this to your attention. The plastic isn't benign. The fish won't pass it. The plastic is full of persistent organic pollutants, things like PCBs, DDT, PAHs, things that are known human carcinogens and endocrine disruptors, things you don't want in your body, but they're in the fish that we eat. I don't want plastic in my sushi. 